assistant uh, to uh, Rumsfeld. I can't call his name. Pearl. Who? Pearl. No, not not Pearl. Wolfowitz. Oh, Wolfowitz, yeah. yeah. Wolfowitz. Hold your point, Minister. We got to go to a top of the hour break. That that's the kind of information though that I wanted you to give us. Carolina High School were injured today when a chemistry experiment sparked that's an great. explosion. That's good. The hazmat crews are still on the scene. A nurse who worked for Michael Jackson took the so many people who don't know that. Conrad Murray today. Sherilyn Lee testified. And they don't know it because the media is bought and paid for. This is a hell of a, a betrayal of the American people when you will not tell them the truth because you're afraid that if you tell the truth, your bosses will take your job from you. That's a hell of a thing. You don't have a democracy when you don't have a free press. You're all slaves and you love it. So you deserve what you get. The erosion of your democracy. You'll soon be the laughing stock of the world. That works out to less than 50 cents a It's a damn shame. That's why the children are occupying space in New York, in Boston, in Washington, in Chicago, in San Francisco, in other cities. Why? Because they're not looking to you as a source of information for them. Look how long it took you all to talk about what was going on in New York. It took you two weeks because the same people that controlled the banks controlled the media. You all know it, but you're afraid to say it. But God put it on Farrakhan to say it for you. And maybe one day you'll get some courage to stand up and give America free media a real free fourth estate but right now you ain't even worth the time of day local news headlines traffic and weather up next on wvo i'm glad hell i'm not hiding nothing <laughs> you need somebody to tell the truth that's right you need somebody that's not afraid to die for the truth that you could be made free because you're not free and you don't really know what it means to really be a free white person a free black person a free mexican a free arab if you're afraid to tell the truth what future does your children have in a society where truth is brushed to the curb i thank god for the young man uh, that invented this wonderful technology. Steve Jobs. Yeah. Steve Jobs. That's the man that's freeing the whole planet where Zbigniew Brzezinski could say yesterday it was easier to control a million people than to kill a million people. Then now he says it's easier to kill a million people than to control a million people because the genie is out of the box, the cat is out of the bag, the people all over the world are waking up and you need to wake up and free America. Then you'll have a future and your children will have a future. But if you're afraid, afraid for what? You're going to die anyway. Right. Where can you run to escape death? If you love America, then fight for America to be free. Yeah, I know. It's probably nothing. Nothing? Yes, sir. I don't know. Like, uh, I'm not in the good, no, the best no, mood, no, brother. I, I, I know you're. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> great. Yes, you're in a great mood. That's right. Stop. No, no, I'm That's fine. Right. Thank you. Can you can turn the top of the hours in a way or get a minister like that. But you know he's doing this. Yes, sir, brother. I know. You're right. You're right. And I bet you were moving and I was pretty mad. I'm not only hurting for Gaddafi. Yeah. I'm hurting for us. Okay. That yeah. thing, who let the dogs out? Good point. Thank you. What has just been done has let the dogs of destruction out. This message brought to you by the American Stroke Association and the Ad Council.